9th September. I'm from the Western Cape, head of the Bay. My reason for coming here, it was because of the challenges I was facing and is to ask God for direction about the problems in my life. I was because in my life it was it's my kids uh, getting into all sorts of trouble and I was asking why this kid is always getting into trouble always it's me it's me that must go and rectify stuff and the other thing that brought me here was my health because in the last few months I see my health it was deteriorating and and also my mother it's also my mother's health I that brought me here and it was to know what God's plan for my life is that is what brought me to Chelsea. Like my eldest son, hey, he was the one I was seeking help for the most because he was always this was it was like something was chasing him. He was always like he was getting into trouble, even if he's not seeking trouble, it's like he will get hurt most of the time. He end up in hospital, uh, like the beginning of this year, New Year's Eve. He had the worst time of my life because he had a fall from double story that ended him in hospital. He had brain, my son had brain injuries. He had bleeding on the brain. His skull was cracked and his eardrum was, and he was on life support for a while. That was bringing me before him. He was abused. People are using him. He have a good heart, but always that heart is getting him into trouble. Friends will, will, will steer him in the wrong direction. And he is believing in people too much. He loves people too much and believing in people. And then trouble come. I There was time I must get him out of, of a jail cell for helping somebody. And this people, person thought it was him doing the crime. It wasn't him doing the crime, but it was uh, the other. He was trying to cover this boy that was injured. And the boy saw him and they said it was him. It was police problems. It was hospital problems. It was people always knocking at my door for this child. And the thing is, they finished my trick. It looks like their life is going away. It's like they are stuck. Jobs, it will be minor jobs, maybe for two months, three months, and it's finished. Two months, three months, it's finished. And they are bright children. They are very bright children, but it looks like their life didn't have direction at all. My health, it was these problems of the kids. It stressed me too much, very much. It stressed me because no mother likes her children to be in trouble. I was talking to them. This thing, I, I landed me in the doctors. They said, I have BP, high blood pressure, and this BP was giving me pains in my left side. It's like almost like a feeling stroke coming. It was like that. That how my BP was. And at night I was I was asleep, and I'm sleeping. It's almost like it is. It's attacking me more at night. This this thing of BP I will feel when I wake up. It's like my head, my left leg is so heavy. There's pains in my left side and my arm side. I say, hey God, what is this now? Why are these things following me? I have so much to do still for you. How oh God, these things are following me. Then I said, no. And my pastor asked me to come here. And then I said, I will come. I will come with him to cherish. And it's also my marriage. It's, it's, it's like we are disagreeing on most things. It's, I say this, he say that. It's like we are not united when it comes to visions for the future. That's what brought me here. Today I had the opportunity to meet the prophet. And what he was saying to me, he was asking me about where I'm staying. I told him where I was staying. And then he asked me, where are my kids? I told him my kids are oh, at home. Yes, they're dead. Then he was asking me, where is my mom? I was saying to him, no, my mom is at her home, also there where we are staying. And he said, well, I must pray. I must pray for my mom. 
and I must pray for my kids because my mom is, is seriously ill but I must pray a lot for them because they are in trouble and he said also I, the other thing the prophet was prophesying about me he said I have many dreams or dreams some are not from God and some are from God he said to me there's dreams I got then uh, the dream in the dreams there's it's like they're trying to feed me stuff in the dream I confirmed it to be true because I experienced it when when I'm dreaming I'm waking up then I'm so nauseous so nauseous so nauseous I must run to the bathroom because something is not right because it, I, I was waking up out of the dream and this thing was happening to me I was always telling my husband hey I was dreaming this thing is happening to me what is this now but the prophet was prophesying about it I confirmed it to be true and he also uh, talking about the dreams I'm getting that is from God he said we are dream I'm dreaming a lot and I must concentrate on the dreams that I'm getting from God it's, it's, and it's true it's confirmed to be true and I get many dreams I can identify which are from God and which are not from God because the ones from God it's like they don't leave you you can you, there's intense power in their dreams and I dream and then that dream is coming to pass and he was prophesying about that he said when you are dreaming your dreams come to pass you will see your dreams coming to pass I can confirm it to be true because it's the truth when I'm dreaming my dreams come to pass I always am dreaming, maybe of my husband's at work, I'm dreaming of his colleagues working with him. I'm dreaming and I'm telling him, you must be careful of your, your colleagues because I was dreaming they are about to do best stuff to you. And maybe while went on and then he was saying, you were right. The dream you had it was right. They, they were planning against me. It's, I was always dreaming of, like, I, was, I can dream about somebody um, that that is about to pass on and then I will see it it is happening it is happening so I confirm it to be true it, uh, it, it, it was uh, there's no feeling to describe how I was feeling but there there was so much joy to hear that God knows what is happening in my life it was so it's joyful to hear that I'm not alone <laughs> and God is God knows what is happening and my challenges of what is happening in my life I was grateful to know that there's real men of God like him I was so grateful because I went to other churches before seeking especially for this son of mine seeking for help for the oldest one I went there but I get direction but it didn't come and that's why I said oh God even my husband was saying even if I must put me into debt again to seek help for this child because it's like death is wanting this child then he said no I confirmed it to be true but the thing is I was going I was long time I was traveling for answers but now I really know he is a true man of God. He is because I don't know Charis. It's my first time coming here, the first time meeting them. I always see them on YouTube videos. It's the first time for me to come here to put my feet on this ground. For him to talk into my life the way he did, as if he is he, he's, he's, he's seeing it, I know it's God. I know it's God doing it for me. I will say to people facing the same challenges. As me. Don't wait. Make haste to come to Charis. There's true people of God in this world. There are some fake ones, but there's true people of God in Charis. Make haste to come here. You don't have to sit in your troubles. You don't have to go through what you are going through. There is a solution, and Charis is the solution for us. <laughs> Everything that is bad is always happening.
first of January this month. Sure, it was like we were losing you as on life support. Because I said, where are your children? Because I was just in sickness also. Uh, yes, mama is ill, even your child is ill. You hear me? Yes, so start. They are finished with trip. They are going to prosper. Yes, but... You, you are coming for the first time, isn't it? It's my first time here. Yeah. It's my first time. Let's see when you go back. <laughs> oh, Jesus, thank you. Yes. <laughs> Jesus mighty. Oh, Rabba Satalabo Satalabos. Rocotalabo Satalando Bosseketi. Lacatalaboce. Randobo Salanabando Socotoloboce. Rundo Bosacatala Catende. Rutonabando Satalabose. Ricata. Rocotalabo Satabando. Rundo Bosacatale Bende. Ratalabo. Ricatala Catalabonde. Rusatolobo Sato. Rucotolobo. Rando. Shitalabasa, Rosarabe Sandoboso, Rosso, Rotalabasa, Landobo, Seket, Elebesondo, Rotobos, Rotalabasa, Cata, Locotolabandobo, Seket, Holobode, Ratalabasa, Catolo, Cotende, Ratala, Rocotecate, Rucuturuba, Sacatalabo, Rendebe, Satala, Rondobe, Seket, Holandobo, Sacat. Leshete, rundrobo satalabase, rukotelebas sandabo sakatale, riketelebase, rundo kosalakata endebose, rutobose, rukotelabasa kata, rondo bosondo bose katalabonde, rakatolo kose, russo kotelobo sandobose, lasa, lokoto, riketa, rando bosotobo sakata, rando bose, russe keta, lando, reke, roko, ra, ro, rindebe. Sata Rose.